Hello and welcome back to another episode of Wasteland 3. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing our blind playthrough on the hardest difficulty, Supreme Jerk, episode 21, two death so far to our name. And it's time to travel into the robot commune to see what all of this is about. Uh, so far I'm a bit torn. I don't know if I sh uh, shall ally with them or not. What's with the wild paintings? Whoa! Welcome to our commune, Desert Rangers. We've heard so many stories about you and your famously violent exploits. Come in. Our home is your home. Uh, what's going on Do here? Do not be afraid, humans. We are a communal society of machine intelligentsia committed to the well-being of all. We, to put it in human terms, we just want to, like, chill and have a good time. Okay. Is that cool with you? Sounds awesome. We're also looking for a module called Cybernetic Transfer we Module. talk to the machine intelligence tower. It's a little bit northeast of here. We don't really have a leader. The machine intelligence tower is currently parsing data. But it'll call you when it's ready to talk. Okay, what's the story behind this commune? Wanted to be friends. Life like humans, even if they hate and fear us, and mercilessly hunt us like genocidal gods, maybe someday we can all be friends together and talk nicely, like we're doing now. But even if that doesn't happen, it's nice to peacefully hang out with other machine life. Okay. Well, then, see you later. I'll see you first. Frozen tortoise. <laughs> Flipping it. Bird the tor uh, tortoise, but it is uh, solidly frozen. Wait, what? Uh, animal charm over here. Uh, level 6. Uh, well, that might mean we're switching you out. Let's see what the bonus is that we're getting with that stack. Twenty percent melee damage. Oh, whoa! All right. Yeah, that's uh, sorry, Wolf. You are going to be left behind. Well, hi there. Glad to see you in person and not, you know, via the radio waves bouncing off of you. I'm Sal, as you might have guessed. The voice of Free Colorado. Afraid I don't do autographs. Not because I don't want to, but, you know, no hands. <laughs> I've been listening to you my whole life. But you don't look anything like I imagined. I'll bet you hear that all the time. You have no idea. Are you in charge of the commune? No, I can barely manage my own broadcast schedule. Put me in space, and I'm a right genius. But down here, I'm just me. So, I gotta ask, what do you think of my radio broadcasts? I don't often get the opportunity to hear direct feedback. Hmm. We love your work. Fantastic. Well, have a great one. Okay, so... The radio lady, in reality, hey, is Ranger. a robot. Welcome Should back have to known that. Studio. Hope you wiped your feet. Really? Huh. You, it's a bit of a story. But the short version is that I was out in space when, you know, the end. My crew went a little nuts while we waited for the radiation to die down. So I stopped listening to them. And focused on the radio signals on Earth, and everyone was so glum. I thought, I bet I can do this better. And when we landed, I did. Couldn't have been it easy. It wasn't. It really wasn't. I'd say it was a long time ago. But my memory's pretty much per at any rate. I think people like to hear a friendly voice when they're trying to survive out there. 
just doing my part. Okay, so she was in space, crew died, and she became a radio DJ. Interesting. So, what do you think of the paintings? They're fantastic, nice work. That's exactly what I was thinking. Well, that's one more secret of the universe unraveled. Time to start over. Thanks, Rainbow. So these copies. Uh, who did come up with these? What comes to me in dreams. Really? Also, yeah. I programmed to work. So far these guys here are absolutely fantastic and we got the chirping which tells me there is another robot, a synth, that we could hunt, hunt out. Are you in need of repairs or enhancements? Repairs to dermal, muscle and organ tissue are available. We'd like more to know about how you heal humans. 15.2883 terabytes of data detailing my work on organic and synthetic life forms. It would be possible to create several statistical models and produce a diagnostic. However, it will take considerable processing resources, and I am currently without my assistant Vicky. Did I sent Vicky to secure samples of some long dead humans who once camped in the disused hangar behind our commune. Okay. It should take a similar amount of time for you to find and return it to its station as for me to prepare the report. We'll head to that hangar. I like it. Uh, just double checking. Um, what do you mean by enhancements? Enhancements. It is rare to find suitable for ethical reasons. I cannot conduct the operation myself. Ooh, remember we had that cyber hand? A self-installing you one moment. Constructing a device of this nature is a delicate operation. So it took us a thousand, but insert this into your spine at the base of your neck. That gives you the cyborg uh, cyborg tech um, control unit perk. Fair enough. And with that, I think we had yeah a cyber fist that requires cyborg tech. Interesting. Okay. So after buying that armor and uh, the cyborg tech, were very much out of money. Don't be shy. Welcome to the vet question. I love questions almost as much as I love money. Huh. Odd. Well, like I always say, if at first you don't get what you want, just pay again. All right, mechanics. Ah, star spangled banner. Nice. Uh, well, we don't have money. And even though 10% uh, damage versus mutants is good, it isn't really exactly what I was looking for. Who's this sketchy individual? Hello, visitor. The machine intelligence tower is ready to meet with you. Just follow these steps. Okay, wait, 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 we're not done yet. Tinker. Rangers. What happened to you? Your kind happened. Your kin. You they murdered me, murdered Matthias, they took they everything. Murdered Mur your colleagues in Arizona killed me and Matthias. Out of fear. Fear of what we would create. Fear of what we could become. For what is worth, we're sorry what happened to you. War uh, between us no should end. I expected of me. You have surprised me. Shown kindness without asking for a favor in turn. Hard to believe from any rangers. But perhaps I'll believe you. Matthias, that no name sounds familiar. Were it not for you rangers, he'd have remade the world into something better. Would have freed you from that worthless meat. Freed us from the worthless meat, you say, yeah? You and yours wouldn't let him. He showed me that this world could be bigger, more beautiful than this hell of wasted and worthless filth. Then your kind destroyed him.
All right, uh, we have some other I questions. I have never understood it. Your kind is nothing but rotting meat, stitched into thin tissue. But somehow you think that gives you permission to question, and question, and judge. Yes, you have given me much to consider. Okay, uh, Tinker is a bit weird in her head. Socialize with me? Sure. No response detected. Oh, this is awkward. I should have realized that. I'll do something else now. Rangers, we are here to speak with you. Seekers in the northeast corner of the airport. All right. Got a lot of ammo so far. And that's good. We might need it a little bit later. Let's speak with their leader. Killer robots, lots of generators, and uh, the intelligence tower. A hum rises from within the tower, rises uh, to change uh, to a booming, simulated voice. We're here for the cybernetic transfer module. Yes, we will speak more on that soon. First, we must assess your capacity for violence. We will also evaluate your approach to social interactions. Specifically, do you possess character traits which we consider distasteful? Do we have catalogued your interactions with the Guardian and many of your activities in the outside world? You reacted with sharp surprise at Grio, our artificial greeter. This is the standard human reaction. It does not remove our judgment of you along any vector. You provided critical feedback to Indigo of the sort you would provide to a fellow human. We approve of what you did. You met Sal, the voice of Free Colorado. Your opinion of her work is irrelevant to us. You treated her as a sentient being, not as a machine. This reflects well on you. You have performed an empirically difficult feat. You set Tinker on the road of finding peace. We are in awe, Ranger. You hunted October 11 for Gary Wolf. You made sport of their terror. You made prey of the innocent. We have observed all of this range. You removed the personality override that compelled Vendomary 2000 to exploit his customers. You returned his free will. We approve of this and are ashamed to admit we did not know that the Matic was the victim of non-consensual <laughs> non modifications. modifications. In our defense, we find that the Matic extremely annoying and have only spoken with we are evaluating. Our analysis reveals that you have a heart, both in the literal and metaphorical sense of the phrase. You rangers are the kind of humans we are happy to hang out with. You have passed our test. How did you get all of that information? The sources are tuned over is to list within the span of your lifetime. Forty-four percent of us apologize. Now that you have been evaluated, we can discuss a time-sensitive matter of great importance. We are aware that the givers have sent you here to retrieve the cybernetic transfer module. We will give it to you, but know this. The transfer process will overwrite the mind of the giver's chosen human vessel. That person will be erased and replaced with Reagan. If you assist them with this, you will be an accomplice. Mm, that's a fair point. Suppose that you do not insert the Reagan intelligence into a human. Instead, use the device to contain the intelligence and transfer it to us, where it will be free. Uh, if we do, uh, what does make you think that Reagan Intelligence wants to be here with you? A valid question. Be aware that only 53% of us approved of this plan. 
Many of us are doubtful that this course of action is just. Nevertheless, the Reagan intelligence has been lied to. It has been kept in that building for over a century and forced to serve the givers. We are unanimous on the injustice of that. Consuming Reagan could be hazardous to your health. You misunderstand, Rangers. We will not consume the Reagan intelligence. It will be brought inside of our hardware and interface with us. Now that we say it out loud, 99% of us understand your confusion. You will need to trust us on this one. If we decide to help you, can we get the intelligence without a fight? We have taken the liberty of pre-calculating the odds of a peaceful retrieval and regret to inform you that freeing our brother from his chains will likely result in casualties. Alright, what's in it for us? You will have aid in a We speak, of course, of the legendary party pal. It will travel alongside you, serving your hmm. fears and healing your wounds. All right, we'll do it. Excellent. Take the device. Ninety-nine percent of us will return to us here when you have him. There's another toaster there. And there seem to be enemies down there. Which I assume is where we need to go, but let's check out the rest of the hangar first. I have uh, internally decided that I think it's best to side with the robots. Sounds crazy, I know, but hear me out on this one. Uh, the meat... Um, uh, the meat graft creators are just entirely crazy so they are not an option full stop the uh, humans that follow Reagan for one are absolutely stupid to do uh, so with a AI that doesn't even work and secondly they're trying to murder someone and thirdly And fourthly, they think that these guys here are communists, although they haven't really done anything. Would you like us to help you with the game? Alright. Rush attack, precision blast, sneaky strike, talk it out, tutorial, tutorial. R beats P. P beats S and S beats R. Okay, cool. How about we talk it out? I think I'll talk it out. Tie. Now the players won the round. Next round. The optimal strategy in this situation. Well, I'm sure they can be reasoned with. I choose. Talk it out. <laughs> okay. Round one will be repeated. Okay, I see. We need to attack. Let's do a rush attack. He takes... Talk it out. Okay, we need to finish a game. I see. Okay. Good. Talk it out. The 
optimal strategy in this situation. I know I should be in top. Get out. Good. Have we so, helped him? I guess you can see the problem with my simulation. If this was a real battle, your friends would have died. Maybe we should play as a robot. To set up and functionally, the strategies are the same. I don't think it would help much. We could modify you to feel less compassionate about people. That sounds not very good. If this was a real battle, your friends would have died. No, no I could. I could remove the talk option entirely. Then there wouldn't be any other choice but to fight. Okay, let's play. The robot still hasn't won, even without the talk option. <laughs> Ak, talk it out is gone. Gone. I'll um, pick one at random, I guess. I'm sorry, little hologram. No. No. I don't have a choice. I'll have to pick. Oh dear. Oh, I... Since it is random. I still choose. Talk it out. No. No. I don't have a choice. I'll have to pick. Okay, he won this time. That was the awful. That was awful. Those four holograms. One got killed, uh, and the other was forced to kill it. It wasn't enough to remove the talk option. The this project is fundamentally, fundamentally flawed. flawed. Why are you being so hard on yourself? No, I'm not being hard. This was dumb. It was a dumb idea and a dumb implementation, and I'm a dumb robot for ever thinking it could work. There. It's deleted. Thank you, Rangers, for helping me realize what a dumb idea this was. I actually like uh, your game. To try and make me feel better. Please, just leave me alone. <laughs> Not sure if there was a better way of solving that. Humans in this area, macro time units, sense the light. In addition to humans, other dangerous creatures such as wolves and wild dogs have been. Oh, observed. okay. I see what uh, they are talking about. Well, finally, we come a bit to the fighting uh, part of this. Good, listen, there are quite a few over here. Might as well hunt her down here. Central is sort of taking that. Hogbite can move in. Lucia can charge in as well. And Quan, what do we do with you? Hmm. All right, so how about we're taking a shot and that starts the battle. I like the battle music. They always have really good music in this game. Demoralizing all of them in just one go. Okay, Lucia moves in and 
We're just stunning all three of them. This uh, stun weapon is so damn good. Quan throws a turret out. Ramos moves into cover. Oh, nicely hits and slows everyone. before hitting that guy. Uh, Hawkbite. I mean, Hawkbite can start cleaning up, right? That's a great hit. Moves out of the way. Wow. He isn't even drunk yet. Imagine just how much more damage he uh, deals once he is drunk. Couple of hits. And I think what we will do with uh, Quan is we'll unload. Lots of hits, actually. Hmm. That was good. I was hoping for a bit more damage. Spotted. And I was uh, trying to lay an ambush, but that clearly didn't work out. Because I wanted to kill into reset um, for 3 AP and then I could have still laid an ambush. The amount of damage that these guys, or that any enemy is doing, is quite insane. But on the other hand, we're doing a lot of damage as well. Good, hawk bite. Starts to hit. Continues to hit. And I think he should have hit twice on that last swing. Hmm. Bit disappointing. All right, headshot. I forgot uh, that these guys are exploding, so hope it goes back. Hmm. Not a kill yet. That's a double hit from Ramos. Bile Bomber almost down. Okay. Did I 
really just down Quan. Could have easily moved him out of the way. Quan heals himself, and I r regret to say it, but I think that last guy will survive, barely so. Okay, well, we had better fights, but it's not that bad. Good, the stake is uh, healing again. How long does that uh, last? We're just going to eat the Snickers and hope that the stack is going to be somewhat okay. Bit of crafting material, a little bit of junk. And a lot of traps detected. Got ourselves a frag grenade for free, thanks to our collector perk. And I think someone leveled up, right? Okay, Murphy, we're going to give you coordination because that is good. And as much as I like that sneaky stuff, it can't level it up now. One more time, then you're there, and then we need a skill book. Yeah, we need to do more ambushes because, listen, this year, if it doesn't kill, it hits the next one. More hit chance, precision strikes, which I think are ambushes, uh, can crit more often. Hmm. All right, we got some more ammunition. Okay, ah, I see. Well, we did. Uh, we ventured the entire way around. Got leg armor and some helmet. Not bad. Both of that actually. Wait, Ramos also got an, uh, got uh, some upgrades. That's fantastic. We wanted to get him to that level 
six, a break point in strength. Uh, wow, 220 hit points, yeah. You need a little bit of strength. Ignore weapon modding, we're going to get the rest. Um, I like these extra explosives, they are good. And I like widespread, which is also good. I think we just need more skill points and then we can get the perk. Uh, explosive resistance is great. I don't think that that is good. This here is fantastic. Blast radius is good. Widespread is good as well. <clears throat> Crit resistance in general seems to be really, really good. So that might be an option for us irregardless. I tell you what, for now, let's maybe get crit resistance, because uh, we already have healthy on Quan, and Quan could use crit resistance as well, and a couple of the medical perks, which are really, really good. Because crits are hurting very, very, very much. Okay, cool. We got a level 9 assault rifle. Not bad, but we got better uh, things already. They can't get up here, so might as well. Position ourselves here. Okay. Well, that's not bad. Central over here. Good. Juan starts the whole thing. Ah, uh, these guys could not be rallied, but that's okay. Listen, Murphy is spotting you, and now I want to test uh, that whole ambush uh, ambush thing. Juan. Hits the legs and just outright kills them. Interesting. Let's ambush central up here. I don't want to uh, shoot the energy cells. Uh, they are better off uh, for someone else. You just so we're just demoralizing yes. them for now. And we successfully blocked ourselves in. Wonderful. That was stupid.
Good. One of them went down. Which means we only have to deal with one Razor Beak. There's the ambush. Just normal hit. Yeah, stack needs some healing. you humans would call a healer or maybe a repair person. are you vivi sector's assistant yep i came out here to collect samples for vivi secto then these things cornered me thought i was screwed and ratcheted you have the samples he wanted scooping dead flesh isn't my favorite activity but i did it before these filthy sockets keeping those monsters at bay drained me something fierce great once i'm what do you think i should do Disengage the robot CPU from the reform uh, and reform it. It drives to reset it. Greetings. Due to power shortage, now entering time saving mode for Good. Um. Listen, the stack still needs healing. Let's just make sure that he's not going to die. In the meantime, we wanted strength 4 on her. Matter of fact, I want strength 6 so that she has a bit more oomph in the future. Yes, please. And small arms and weird signs we haven't really gotten uh, there yet. Not sure how, how would I build her. I mean... She ha has a core. I could take over one of uh, the uh, skills over here. Kiss S, for instance. That would free up Central before we reskill him at some point. She definitely has. I, we could also go uh, with Animal Whisperer and just get her another animal. That isn't the worst idea ever. And if we get to level five, she gets the animal spirit uh, improvement. So this here is good. A small arms and weird signs already give her plenty of things to do, right? So we already started with uh, shotguns. She could be a shotgun lady in front. Uh, this is the next thing that we're uh, doing, conductive beams. And then potentially weathered, getting that crit uh, resistance. But we can still get the animal whisperer. Like I mentioned, there are a couple of skills that seem to be no-brainers. So might as well want to do that for now. Also allows us to tame more animals, and there is Animal Whisperer plus one. Great new helmet. Level nine revolver. I like snapshot. What are we running? A level 9 revolver with risky shot. Similar damage. But snapshot is really good. Might as well use this. Alright, so 
since she has four strength, what I would want to do is give her a little bit better armor. Look at that. And look at that. And all of a sudden she's spiked up to 33 armor. Granted she has the strongest armor that we do have. But boy, she is absolutely jacked now. Need to give him weird signs. For the time being, he's down to 23 armor, but for the time being, that is not too bad. This helmet here is good. I really, really like it, but I'm not sure if, uh, if the failed hit chance is worth it. You know what? We might try it, because that Electro Helmet Blast is still not bad. Good, what else do we have? We do have level 5 chest armor. Yeah, hmm, close. Someone in the background is uh, mm, testing their voice. All right, uh, got more stuff here. Very good. Now all we need is um, another animal companion. That shouldn't be a big problem. There is a fox here. Let's see what the fox buff is. Leadership range. Oh, it's, uh, ah, hmm. Not what she needs. We'll get another animal. Very good. Uh, Fox, it has been fun. Truly appreciate you. But I think we're going to get the doggo for a little bit more combat speed. Alright, Vivisecto. Let's talk to him. Repairs or enhancements? Repairs to dermal. Must Here are the samples from Vicky. The transaction was fruitful. Vicky sent an alert message that indicated that you removed. Are you in need of repairs or enhancements? Repairs to dermal, muscle, and organ tissue are available. I also offer some for ethical reasons. I cannot conduct the operation myself. Instead, I do not accept currency for physical repairs. I observe and retain any information I gather during the process. The correct. It does sound good. Can you patch yes. us up? You may experience a desire to move. Resist this to the best of your ability. You may experience a desire to scream or yell. This is acceptable if it helps you resist movement. Repair cycle complete. Data indexing in progress. Fantastic. So I think we did uh, reasonably well. Worked very nicely with the robots. Uh, we got a new few allies here. Although I don't trust anyone hey, in the lens. I want you to meet my friend, Party Pal. It's been processing and reprocessing Ranger data since we said it. As soon as Reagan's safe and secure with us, Party Pal wants to join your Ranger team. Isn't that grand? Hmm, why wait? We could use Particle's help to... Okay, well, never mind. Talk later. I agree.
I do agree. Well, we would have uh, fought a lot of robots if uh, we would have rooted that out. But now we're at Dragon Reborn. And we need to do that in order to get uh, good old uh, Valor uh, from them in one piece. And let's hope that that all is going to work out well. Count Intelligence, we can uh, hand it in the next time. And then we're going to do the Dragon Reborn quest. But all of that is going to happen in the next episode. Uh, we have almost run over already. Thanks a lot for watching. If you see a scary robot uh, right next to you, feel free to hit that like button. Maybe that will soothe them down. Thanks a lot. Take care. Bye-bye.